So you've got all your lovely retro consoles set up, but they're going to be covered in dust because dust gets everywhere. What are you going to do? Well, you could just throw a towel over them, but then again, that kind of looks ugly. And I know because I did it in the past. What you want is some quality dust covers, and I'm going to show you exactly what they're like and where you can get them. Let's take a look. So while searching around the net for lovely dust covers for my retro consoles, I came across this place known as Printer Boy. Now Printer Boy do all the major consoles, but they'll also be doing the more obscure ones such as PC Engine and who knows, even maybe the analog NT, we don't know. But they will do all sorts of obscure stuff. In fact, I'm waiting for an MSX dust cover to come. Yes, they are the place to go to. But what makes them so different from your regular dust cover manufacturer? Well, let's take a look at this Mega Drive dust cover here. Look at that. I put it on my console and yet I still know it's a Mega Drive because it's printed on the top. Check that out. That is some quality stuff right there. Now, of course, I've gone for the Japanese style, but he will also do the Genesis and the PAL version. And for those who are worried about keeping the cables all connected up, no problem. Because there's a cutout at the back, so all your cables can still be connected. The material they're made of is a kind of canvas. I really don't know the exact material, but it's got a nice smooth finish to it. And it seems to be waterproof as well, or at least splash proof. And on the inside, it's nice and smooth, so it's not going to scratch your console. And it even has a little label here giving you wash directions. Not bad at all. In fact, I really do dig these covers and I got quite a few of them. So let's take a look at the ones I got. So here's the Nintendo Wii cover I got from him. And as you can see, it's designed to go in the horizontal mode, but you can also use it if your Wii is in a vertical standing position because this, this cover comes with a little Velcro strip at the back to keep it on nice and snug. It also has a little pocket on this side, which I'm not really too sure why it's there, but um, it's there. Maybe you put your memory cards in there or something. So why not connect it to a Wii and see how it fits. As you can see, my Wii's got a USB stick sticking out the back of it for some reason. And actually the top of it is pretty dusty. Let's, oh, that, oh man, that's, that's not good. Okay, it's, um, put on this Wii cover. So we'll put it horizontal at first. On the dust cover here. Now I've got to say it does fit really well. Okay, let's stretch that Velcro strip around the back. It's uh, avoiding the USB stick, that's good. Stick on that. Yeah, there you go. My Wii is now going to be free of dust. And if I put it back in its uh, vertical standing orientation, which was this way, yeah, not a problem. The cover stays on. Unfortunately, this side may get some dust against it, but um, that's gonna be against the uh, side of the unit anyway. So yeah, that works fairly well. Very happy with that. He also sent me this Xbox One dust cover now I have the Xbox One X, so I'm hoping this actually fits on it. In fact, I think this is designed for the Xbox One X. So again, it has the uh, Velcro strip on the back and it's got a space so you can have all your you know, hookups still connected. So I'm gonna try that out in a second. But before I do, let me show you. There's also a PS2 Slim and it's in white, which is perfect for myself. So I've got my PS2 Slim over here. Let's just unplug it from the wall. If I can get the cables out. Okay, now I notice I'm going to have to take out the memory cards. That's a bit of a bummer. Okay, out they come. Again, it's got the cutouts at the back for the cables to fit in. So let's uh, get this cover on. Yeah, lovely stuff, look at that. That's great. Oops, get a little bit tidier there, there you go. Lovely stuff. 
And finally, I did get one more from the guy, from Printer Boy, and that is for the Xbox 360. Again, this is designed to go in the uh, horizontal um, storage methods, but my 360 is uh, vertical. So let's take a look and see what that looks like as well. It's even gone to the trouble of putting the hard drive scan on the top. Good stuff.